busy taking care of animals and getting house together for um, the holidays. Um, I'll do a little bit of, of an update. Um, as everyone knows, my hypnotoad, my smooth-sided toad, passed away. Um, I was really, really upset about that. Um, and then, like, two or three weeks before that, my Pac-Man frog passed away. So that month wasn't really good for me. It was quite depressing. Um, the Pac-Man frog was sick, I guess already when we got the, the frog. Um, the smooth-sided toad we had had for close to a year and it was wild caught. Not really sure how old it was. Um, he was eating um, the night before and the morning that I noticed him. Um, at first I thought that maybe he was just buried in and hibernating but I checked on him and he had passed away. So that's been really, really hard. Um, all my other animals are doing really good. Um, I finally got <clears throat> my male bull python ball to eat after four months of him fasting. Um, my little bull python hemi has finally started eating. He uh, didn't eat for like four weeks. Um, my female ball python is doing really well. She eats really good. Um, I got a new puppy from uh, for Yule. And, uh, she's the only animal right now closest to me. And this is her. This is Sif. She's a, an Australian Shepherd um, and Roddy mix. Haven't been getting a lot of sleep lately because of her. So if I look tired, she's why. <laughs> um, holidays were really well. The kids uh, had uh, a lot of fun playing with their Xbox. Um, the Tegus are doing really good. We still haven't decided to hibernate this year. So the food bill and the light bill is still pretty, um, still pretty high. Um, so. Hopefully, maybe next winter they'll hibernate. Um, the retic has grown um, another 14 inches since I've done um, a video on her. So I'll have to do uh, an update video on the retic because she's getting pretty big. Um, the stress of taking care of reptiles and taking care of three dogs and two cats is, is pretty stressful and going gray. So it's time for another hair dye job. Yes, people, I dye my hair. Um, so I'm probably going to go back to black. Um, let's see. My iguana, my iguana Paco is doing really well. He's eating a lot better now, and he's starting to gain um, a lot more weight. Um, let's see. My western toad is doing really well. He's still eating a lot of crickets. Um, that's why I couldn't understand what was going on with the smooth-sided. Sh he shedded like a week before he passed. Like I said, it was still is really, really hard because, yeah, he was he was a uh, one of my really cool uh, reptiles in my collection. Um, rescues are doing really good. Um, I'm going to be getting a red-tailed boa here really soon that I'm going to be fostering. Um, that had a really, really bad case of uh, subtitis. Um, right now, she is still at the vet being tube fed. And uh, this weekend, the vet is going to try and give her a mouse or a rat. I'm hoping that her facial pits haven't been scarred over from it. So if she eats and everything, she'll be coming here and we'll be fostering fostering her until she gets better and then finding her a new home. Our red tail boas are doing really well. They're eating, getting fat. So just a, a small update 
Um, I'll do some updates on some animals here real soon. It's just been kind of a hard, a hard month with um, a couple of my amphibians dying. It, uh, you know, had nothing to do with my care that I give them because I know, I know that I give my animals the best care that that they get. <clears throat> so, um, I probably won't be getting any more amphibians for a while just for the fact because I don't think I could find anything as cool as the smooth-sided and uh, they're kind of hard to find. And I don't think I'll be getting another Pac-Man anytime soon. Um, if I do, I'll probably buy, buy one from um, a breeder and not from anyone local. So um, if you guys are gonna buy a, an, a reptile off of Craigslist, you know, or any animal off of Craigslist, just uh, be real careful on who they are. You know, check out the animal really good because they could just be getting rid of them because they're sick. So, all right. Well, I hope you enjoyed my little video. Sorry there wasn't much animals on it, but my puppy. And we'll be getting some more videos soon. If you guys have any requests for any videos, care sheets, or how to take care of something, let me know. Put it in the description below. And uh, if you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube, like my videos, comment on my videos, and join me on Facebook. And join Midgar on his Facebook. It's uh, Midgar Tegu. So, um, you guys have a great day.